Those swords are a match. So is the ear. Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? <sighs> Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. <laughs> Something odd about this skull, though. It's like it doesn't belong to the stone. I mean, what's odd about it is that's not Avery's sigil. Huh. Yeah, I mean, the skull should be facing... Sideways. Where's that? My God. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh, I've been ready for a long time. Let's see what we got. A crypt? A crypt? Hidden behind a secret door? I assume the secret door was added afterwards. <laughs> to hide his loot. Well, fingers crossed. Oh, gang's all here. Jesus, Dismas on the left. Penitent thief. Guest is on the right. Jerk thief. <laughs> Avery sure had a thing for St. Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Only plundered and murdered the non-British heathens. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. Good enough. Some kind of lamp. Hey, Smokey. Need your lighter over here. You know, that hurts my feelings. Not as much as it hurts your lungs. <laughs> Thank you, Father Duffy. 
Isn't that something? <laughs> the light's coming from the other side of the wall. Right, let's see here. Ah, uh, I can aim the lights. Hey, here we go. I think you got that one. So, connect the dots. That looks right. Nathan, that's it, you got it. Okay, let's give this a shot. Old Ben Sesame. Wrong treasure, Josh. <laughs> well, nice view. No treasure, though. No, but... Look, you see those crosses? Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, is that a cave right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. There's one problem, though. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. And back towards Rafe. Shit. Well, let's not keep him waiting. Follow my lead. Anybody heard from the scout party up here? Nothing. You think we have guests? Aren't I wish? <laughs> the storm has been missing with the radios. It's practically useless. Christ! Someone's here! <laughs> Okay, I think we're clear. Well, that could have gone better. Hey, well, we're still breathing. That's good enough. Let's just get that gate open. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Kind of hoping to find the treasure back there, but you know, it's never that easy, right? 
That's been my experience. Plus, there was that cool constellation thing. Yeah, it was cool. Wow. <laughs> Pretty spectacular. Right under that high cross. That's where Avery wants us. Well, that's what Avery wants, Avery gets. Kid, what's your status? Hey, Sully. We're on the trail, but the uh, treasure's closer to the cathedral than we originally thought. Oh, boy. So what do you need me to do? Uh, just keep those engines warm. We'll be back before too long. You got it. Keep me posted. Will do. Patrol up ahead. I hear him. I guess there's no getting away from these guys. Yeah, and there'll only be more as we get closer to the cathedral. Nathan? Found a ladder over here. Okay, coming. Here we go. Come on, I'll boost you up there. All right. Hell, I'm too high to reach you. Hang on a sec. Hanging. Let me see what's by that wooden structure over there. Too high to reach you. Hang on a second. Hanging. You see what's by that wooden structure over there? This thing's heavy. What exactly are you doing? Giving you a way up. That'll support even your way. Ah, thank you. Hey, you don't think the monks built this? No way. It's some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? To lift something. I can't believe I missed this. Clearly, we were meant to find it together. No, oh, so <laughs> romantic. <laughs> hey, we can climb this! 
On my way. Okay. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Ah. Holy shit! Incoming! That was amazing! Save your strength, huh? Not done yet. Just lead the way. Hope this holds. something after all those years of Panama. <clears throat> Hold on. I'll help you up. <clears throat> there you go. Where would you be without me, huh? Uh, probably at home. Drinking hot cocoa? What are you, five? Oh, tell me you wouldn't go for some hot cocoa right now. Well, I mean, yeah. Exactly. Hey, check it out. Just about there. There's no path along the cliff. All right, let's cut back inland. This sounds good. Go. We're done with these idiots. <laughs> hey, careful. Might be unstable after the blast. Who does excavation with dynamite? Hey, Sam, help me with this. Yo, know, what if it's the only thing holding the tunnel up? Then I'll apologize. All right. There. See? No problem. Yeah, for once.
Those things look sturdy to you? Sturdy enough. Hey, be extra careful on these. Remember, extra careful. Thanks. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh, okay, we're good. We're good. about to head into the cave. Cave? Yeah, might lose contact for a bit. Don't get too worried. All right, I'll keep the porch light on for you. All right, call you soon. <laughs> we made it. It's quite the detour. Well, let's go see what Avery left for us. Yes, please. Souls were right next to this cave. Yeah, but I think we're the first ones in here. Come on, through here. But I didn't eat a big breakfast. Maybe St. Dismas statues? Check. Carved stairs? Check. Nathan, I think it's safe to say we're in a pirate cave. Oh, is that a door? That sure looks like it. Come here. Check this out. A little slimy. There's a handle in here or something. Well, give it a give it a pull. What? Could be a trap. You're already in there. What's the what's the worst that could happen? Uh, I lose my hand? So we'll get you a nice hook. Give it a pull. <sighs> nice hook. All right, here we go. Really? Hello, hello. It's pretty interesting decor. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. To those who prove false, behold your grim fate. Yeah, well, I guess Avery was a better pirate than a poet. This... this isn't Avery's. What do you mean? Look. The Rhode Island pirate. Thomas, too. Yeah, but it can't be him. I mean, this is clearly his sigil, but two died attacking the same treasure fleet as Avery. Yeah, well, at least that's what the stories tell us. If this really is two's mark, then that means he's involved in all of this. How? It's a 
damn good question. So who do you think these guys are? Yeah, those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas, too, are just trying to scare us. Good thing we're jaded treasure hunters. Bridge looks about as safe as the others. Well, it's held up this long. Boom. It's okay, it's holding. Come on. These bridges are clearly not built to cope. Sure they are. The pirate code. <laughs> not bad. <laughs> We're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. This is... elaborate. You could say that. Found another swip. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the hand out. Whoa. Jesus. It's a pretty elaborate... Test? Trial? Yeah. Then this guy clearly failed. Let's do better. There's something on the bottom there. It's a bucket. Huh. Okay. Now what? Ah. Bucket filled. All right, pass it up to me. <laughs> I'll put it back in that big wheel thingy. these wheels do okay I think I see what's going on here Is something with the three crosses yeah I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus our good thief Dismas and the jerk thief Gestus I'm gonna figure the white cross is Dismas so the black one is Gestus Hey, Sam, was Dismas to the left of Jesus? Well, are you looking at them from the front or the back? The front. Then, yeah, he was on the left. Okay, that's what I've got. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. A channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay, so bucket on top is good. Keep it there.
Okay, that's gotta be it. Now let's find out. Let's? So you're gonna pull the switch? Oh, no, no. I'd, I'd hate to deprive you of that privilege. Of course. today so if that was a test who suppose it was testing exactly filling a bucket I had to know about st. Dismas whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with <laughs> not that hard of a test maybe it's not the only one I'm guessing we need to get up to that broken bridge. Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Okay. I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. Sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. Let's see what's in here. There's a low ceiling here. Watch it. Ow! Watch my ah? Right. You need me to slow down for you? This way. Through here. I see some light through here. Ah, catacombs. Uh, that makes sense. We're under a cathedral. Anything noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. it will take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral.
Uh, a little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. Oh, Don. Hey, do you, do you have a trampoline? <laughs> I wish. Hang on. Hey, look at you. One crate coming up. Thank you, good sir. Definitely getting closer to the cathedral. I don't know what's left of it. <laughs> Gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. <laughs> Me too. Must have taken years to build. Bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Here goes nothing. You're not heavier than the crate. Okay. Made it. What's the plan? I'm working on it. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Needs bridges. I don't know. I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? <laughs> Over here. Look at that. If this place wasn't completely falling apart. We'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. This must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is... How the hell do we get to the other side? Hmm. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
That really safe looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. <laughs> Worth the shot. Here goes nothing. I'll weigh it down. Go. No! I'll weigh it down. Go. <laughs> Made it. All right. Uh, now, what about me? Check out all that machinery. You know, really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these death traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Who's being glib? This is a marvel of human engineering. Any luck? Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. You sure that'll work? It's heavier than I am. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Hey, nice air. Oh, crap. I got you. There, thanks. There's another test down. Yeah, at this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Okay. Getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site? Or build elaborate tests? I mean, either we're missing something, or Avery was really, really bored. Ugh. I'll never get used to this. Another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Agreed. Yeah. Or lack thereof. Okay, so. It's, it's gotta be the coins. Yeah. Are we sure about this? Oh, pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Uh, just, just one now. Great, I got it. Please don't be a trap. Recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look, star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with this. What are you talking about?
That's my chance. Didn't we? Yeah, we kicked it, punched it, and set it on fire. Story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, take it. Hold tight. Yes! 
Yes, definitely. Victor saying the weather is lovely this time of year. I can't see shit. Just keep heading down until we hit the water. <laughs> Sam, down here. <laughs> Forget about that, man. Keep shit. moving. <laughs> This one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, Nate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. Suppose it's a start. Do you think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? I, just think about this. Thomas II was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the Gunsway Hall look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? people who survived the caves, the recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. And there's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news, there's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. 
Well, as long as you guys are safe. So, are you gonna start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're gonna need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. That's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here... So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world, so if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here, I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's... Shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy named Antiquity Master 37. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Huh. Not much to see here. Well, nah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. that bridge.
Try going up that hill. We can get to the bridge that way. Cave behind a waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? So, Victor, how is it that you know King's Bay so well, huh? Well, first time out here was for a swap. Stolen diamonds. <laughs> of course. Of course. And in the process of Maybe we can preempt any trouble we might get into. Can you still reach out there? Her. Oh, mistake. It wasn't like that. For it's once. a note. We just saw the world in similar ways. Besides, she moved. Brazil. Been a few years since we've seen each other. Well, maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First, let's wrap this up. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. That's the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go! Made it! Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Hey, just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good! Everything's careful, careful! Oh! Shit, that was close. Onward and upward. Getting nowhere fast. Easy. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. It's going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. Let me go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that again. Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why, exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe, uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, 
The guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. Valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. How to do it? than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, yeah. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> Those poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, it could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Damn. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. Like the point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, it's still taking a long time. Hey, Nathan. Check out that cave there. All right, one sec. Okay, I'll just hang with Victor here. I'm good. Let's go. How would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. And that means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
Okay, I think that's it. God damn it, Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Come on, come on! One down, one to go. Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. No, turn into it. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than rate? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercy. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Just thinking the same damn thing. They found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? I, you know, reading, mostly. There was just one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I try. Uh, ah, no. See that smoke? Shoreline, slow down. tried. I asked them to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. 
I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Oh! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Take a picture of me. Give me a break. Oh, 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 oh. See what's in there. Sully, you were saying? Uh, oh, yeah, right. So, well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense. Like he could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't... Uh... All right, let's go. Sam, what were you talking about? Uh, oh, right. Well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. So, pirate walks into a bar. Okay, here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. The bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, ah, he's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you out here.
Check it out, boys. What is it? Guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys! There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Sam! Special delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! You got this? Mm-hmm. I see it. Hover in the car closer. You just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. <laughs>
not show up. Hi. Now, let's get that bridge down. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Huh. No. Well, it was worth a try. Gonna take a look around. Just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <laughs> right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I'm not exactly expecting to be partners with him. Guys, we're gonna find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me. Here we go! under control. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Hmm. Get in that way. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. <laughs> that 
Let's see what we got here. Huh. There's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Heads up! Jesus! I said heads up! Seems excited. Oh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. You guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's uh. Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell. And that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh, let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Well, maybe, maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, <coughs> whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Son 
son of a bitch! Let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Huh. Sam? Yeah, over here. <clears throat> hey, what are you doing? Confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. Figured out the towers, too. Location, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Less great, Nathan, because neither do we. Guess we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. Coming through. It's a lemur. Come on, come say hi. That's all right. <laughs> so cute. Hey, 
Whoa! Hey! Hey, Sully! <laughs> hey! He stole my apple! Can't trust anyone these days. Mm, that's right. It does smell good. Excuse me. Hey, Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. Long way down. You okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. Okay, let's see what we got. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. This is a very tall clock tower. Yes. Yes, it is. like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. Didn't work, Nate. 
Scorpio. That Avery was a Scorpio.
Fun. Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. 
Ah, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? Well, that's one way to do it. You all right? All right. Sure, why not? Let's see what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally, you okay? Just search my towel. I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. Sully. Way ahead of you. Oh. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah, they got those star patterns on them. They turn, but which way are they supposed to go? Pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. Let's say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condit. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Wow, oh, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. Look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Content went by Billy One Hand. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, I'm not to. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? I bet these line up, too. Hmm.
another doorway. Yeah. So, who are these guys? That's... Um... They are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. These are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. William Mays. American? Yeah, from Rhode Island. Just like Thomas, too. Hmm. Hmm. Nah, nada. Nah. -uh. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. Nada. Nah. -uh. Hmm. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. Is it straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. Hmm. There. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. 
Well, the, the Dolphins are Richard Warren, the Trident is Joseph Farrell, and the Two Hands with the Pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. What is that statue holding in May's portrait? Well, the ship was named the Pearl, so maybe a pearl? Ah, very literal.
there. Okay. So who do we have here? Uh... You know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful, that's all. Aha, uh -huh. of course. Shit. What happened here? A uh, torch probably fell or something. Come on, let's see what's left. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. Ooh, Sam texted me back. Now, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Gloating is unseemly. Huh. No name. This guy's get-up looks Moorish. Found the stars, but who are you? Huh. Yazid al-Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the Muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. <laughs> yeah, like that's ever the case. All right, I got the names of two of them. We should still be able to figure this out.
Boom. Ah. Look at that. What do we got? Ah, uh, not sure yet. Maybe send it to Sam? Really? Hey, you're the one who said he's the pirate expert. Just saying. Okay, that's one. And two. Last one. All right, let's see what he makes of them. You know, that kind of looks... Huh. What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Yeah, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh. All right, these could be trade winds. Yeah, and these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, Boyle. What? Pro Deus quod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, so obvious. Nate. Why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? <laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. It's been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner... Sully. I think that's Sam's tower. It's definitely Sam's tower. Come on. This way. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. What? How long you think before Rafe gets here? <laughs> Let's not stick around to find out. Sorry, pal. Come on, down here, Nate. Nate, watch out! Shit! Everyone out of the way! Brilliant. Nick, Mora. Shit. Hang on. No. 
Idea, Nate. Do you want to drive? Oh, you're doing just fine. <sighs> See? Oh, crap. These guys don't give up. Okay, through here. Oh, stop, stop, stop! Oh, stop. Come on, come on, get out of here. Okay, go. Uh, I'm just gonna cut oh. through here. Oh, man, oh, man. What am I supposed to do now? Hey, get up those stairs.
time to fail. Way he could have survived that. Why chance it?
Yeah. <laughs> you good? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out of here. I think the coast is clear. Yeah. All right. Pro Deus Cord Licentia. This looks like a simple cipher. Forgotten liberty. I mean, it's their damn motto. All the paradise references. I can't believe we missed it. See you two made it out, okay? Way better than okay. We found Libertalia. <laughs> Liber... Clipper, what are you? Libertalia. Seems Avery founded the legendary pirate colony. Uh, it's more of a pirate utopia, really. Okay, but what about the treasure? See, as the story goes, this place provided a safe haven for hundreds, maybe even thousands of pirates, and they, they shared everything. Property, resources... Money? And they kept it all in one common treasury building. Okay. So, where is this... Kami Pirate Sanctuary. Right here. That island, just northeast of Kings Bay. <laughs> hey, Rafe has a copy of this. Yeah, well, by the time Rafe figures it out, we'll be well on our way to Libertalia. I'm telling you, that treasure is as good as ours. <laughs> Shit.
How's the Malaysia job going, Nate? Seems like you're a hair off course. Elaine, it's... It's not what it looks like. Really? Because what it looks like is that you're searching for Henry Avery's buried treasure. And given the shoreline soldiers that are all over town, I'd bet you're not the only ones looking for it. All right, well, I, I guess it's kind of what it looks like. But, but I can explain. Look, it's gonna sound crazy. Try me. Well, for starters, um, this is uh, Sam. Sam Drake, my brother. Hi. I'm sorry. I, I thought he had died in a Panamanian Neat. jail, but I was obviously very wrong. He's been stuck in there for 15 years, and it's because of me. And the guy who broke him out wants a lot of money, and the only way we can pay off the debt is Avery's treasure. But, but that's the good news. We, we found it. it, it it's, it's on an island just off the coast. Okay, just stop. Was there ever a Malaysia job? I... Okay. Come on, come on, wait. Elena, wait! I don't get you. Look, I, I wanted to tell you. You know what, enough! No, I wanted to, but how could I? I don't know, just say it. I had to protect you. That is bullshit, Nate. You just didn't have the nerve to face me again. I, I knew you would react like this. How would you react? You lied to me. For weeks. If you were killed, I... I wouldn't have even known about it. And now you have a brother. Who are you? Come on. I'm me. Come on, it's me. It's different this time. Oh my God. I have to save him. I don't even care about the treasure. <laughs> 